All right, <clears throat> Shalom. We start off by giving all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai. No double honors to the apostles and the lords of Great Millstone. And salutation to the Akemo that are pushing you with all truth and sincerity. And this is Brother Nathan, you know, from GMS Trinidadis. You know, and I just want to do a short sit down on, um, you know, uh, the reason why everybody can't get this truth. Right? There's a reason why uh, the Christians can't get this truth. There's a reason why the Catholics can't get this truth. Right? There's a reason why the um you know two thirds of Israel can't get this truth. Right? There's a reason why the Muslims can't get this truth. Right? There's a reason why the Baptists can't get this truth. Right? There's a reason why the Moabites, right? He saw, right? He saw called white man, you know, um, Jap he so called Japanese man, right? He so called Arab man, right? He so called East Indian man. There's a reason why they, um, there's a reason why they can't get this truth, right? Because, uh, the scriptures was given, uh, first and foremost, not first, but holy and solely to Israel right and it was it wasn't given to the to all of Israel if it was given to all of Israel because the, the tutors would have you know the tutors, the tutors would have had this knowledge right <clears throat> but oh, there's an elect in Israel that's gonna have this word and that's gonna receive the secret of the scriptures the mystery and and that, that, that they were able to to break it on right uh, this Amos chapter 3 verse 7 it says surely the Lord power will do nothing but reveal it his secrets unto his servants the prophets so Yahweh Hashem Yahushai didn't reveal the secret to everybody he said surely he will do nothing right but we but he but revealed his secret Unto his servants, the prophets. Not everybody is a servant of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai. Right? That's one thing you need to get clear. Not everybody is a servant of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai. Right? Two thirds of Israel and the other nations are, are servants of of um of or of Jesus Christ. Right? They are servants of um um. You know they like to say God, right? Or Jehovah, or you know all these sort of different names they like to call him Mosai, right? They are servants of um of Christianity and Buddhism, right? Also, all sorts of doctrine. They are they are servants of Allah, right? They, I mean, they are servants of all. Of all different sorts of doctrines and all different sorts of idols, right? Also, uh, also, um, even things of this world, they are still ones to the to the kind of things of this world, right? But Moses says, surely the Lord Power will do nothing but reveal His secret unto His servants, the prophets. And our song, so it's not everybody's going to reveal it. um the Mosa is gonna to choose to reveal um his secret. He's not gonna he's not gonna choose everybody to receive um this secret, right? It's a precious thing. So the Lord Ham picked, you know, his spirits to receive this will from the foundation of the earth. Right? Because the scripture says what well, my child thou has known the holy scriptures. Alright, which goes back to your spirit. Right, like I was telling um one of my brothers um last night is that sometimes I meditate and you know I just say you know to what are you because from from the foundations of the earth because the scripture says what the spirit of the prophets is subjected to the prophets. Right? So I was just telling my brother last night that um you know it's really a nice thing that you know you know choose my spirit, even his spirit and all, from the foundations of the earth to receive this knowledge. 
because you know we we cannot be offered the tutors right now you know but the most i chose our spirit to receive this knowledge you know so that's a every day you know i mean you have to meditate upon this word and say you know to you know because it, it was his will for us to receive this this knowledge right because if you're gonna say we we are one of the few we are one we are one i, I am one of the few who receive this knowledge right there's only a handful of israel is going to receive this word right um so let me just get uh, Matthew. This is Matthew chapter 13, verse 10. And the disciples came and said unto him, Why speakest thou unto them in parables? Right? Because this is how Yahweh spoke. Right? When Yahweh speak, he didn't speak for everyone to understand right it's more like more or less like speaking in code right so what let's say that there's three people in, in a room right and if I'm speaking right and this person and the other person knows me right and I do and I want to say something to him without him knowing right I will speak to him a particular way so he will have an idea or he will understand what I say. But the other person, they wouldn't understand. Right? Because me and him, both of us know the code. Then we know how each other speak. We know how we speak to each other. Right? So this is how Yahusha speak. Right? He's speaking parables and he's speaking in a way not for everyone to understand. Right, because simply because not everyone is gonna get this truth. Right? Not everyone is gonna receive it and also take heed unto it. As why scripture said, two tools that Israel shall cut off and shall be cut off and die. Right? So Matthew 13 and 10 says, And the disciples came and answered. So the disciples came and said unto him, Why speakest thou unto them in parables? And he answered and said unto them, because it is given unto you to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven but to them it is not given so Yahweh knew that it, that this word wasn't for everybody right he knew that it wasn't for everybody so therefore he speak a particular way right understand so I'm just getting some because Yo, the Mosai, your boy Hashem, your Hashem, your great. You understand? Your boy Hashem, your Hashem, your great. This is um. Isaiah twenty nine and ten. It says, um. It says for for the Lord for your hour. I pour upon you the spirit of deep sleep, and I close your eyes. The prophets and, the, and your rulers, the seers, had he covered. Yeah, because he, he pour upon your spirit of deep sleep, right? Because not everyone is going to wake up to this wood, right? Not everyone is going to wake up to this wood. Understand? So he so he pour upon the two thirds, the spirit of deep sleep. Right? That go back to like um Ezekiel. Ezekiel um thirty seven. Right? That is all uh, the two thirds are as well as, as dry bones. Right? Scripture also says what my people are foolish and they know nothing. You know? Because he has see how the scriptures line up? It says my people are foolish right they have not known me right and in Isaiah 29 and 10 it says that he had poured upon them a spirit of deep sleep you understand um let me just get go on. I mean it, 
it, it is in Israel spirit, right? To search for the Mosai, but it's not the Mosai will for them to for everybody to get. You understand? Uh, Romans 11 and 7. I say, What then? Israel had not obtained that which he seeketh for. So Israel, Israel will seek. Right? Israel will seek. That's why you'll find um, um, in the churches around the world. Who you'll find in churches? You'll find Jake. Right? You'll find Jake in almost every church there is. Understand? Right? Um, it says, What then? Israel had not obtained. That which he seeketh for, but the election had obtained it, and the rest were blinded. Right? Only the election is going to obtain this truth. Right? But the rest of Israel is blinded from this truth. They're not going to receive it. Right? According as it is written. Now, when it says according as it is written, um, power had given them the spirit of slumber. Right, and where where was it written? It was written in the Old Testament, right? For for the people who like to just go by the New Testament alone, right? And and you know just do away with our whole Old Testament thing and, and just live off the New Testament, right? So just as it says here, according as it is written, power had given them a spirit of slumber. Right? Eyes that they should not see, and ears that they should not hear unto this day. And back in Isaiah 29 and 10, right? it says, For, the, for Yahweh had poured upon them a spirit of deep sleep, and had closed their eyes. You know? So it's the same thing. Where was it written? It was written, I read in Romans here, and it was written in the Old Testament in Isaiah. So that is to, that is to show how these scriptures. Old Testament and New Testament line up. Understand? Alright, so he says, as it is written, power had given them the spirit of slumber, eyes that they should not see, and ears that they should not hear unto this day. You know? So, um, so yeah, that was just a, you know, just a, a quick thing. To show that you know there's a reason why not everyone is gonna right agree with what um you know the brothers the apostles and the brothers from from great millstone will will speak or will say right there's a reason why you'll find two thirds of Israel in churches right and not on the streets right on that camp or something like that on the great millstone or you know or you know brothers who have the truth you won't find them there you won't you won't find them outside on the streets doing new works in garments in sackcloth the fringes you won't find that right and you want the, the ones who, who who are like that is the ones who receive the world receive the truth of your scriptures right namely um, great millstone, right? There are brothers who are not on the great millstone who have the truth as well. Right? For like, for example, example, um, men of valor, you know, shall I want to you, brothers, you know, they have the truth as well, right? There are people outside of GMS who has the truth, but like I said, in terms of receiving this word, right, it was only given to the servants of, of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh not the servants of God and Jesus Christ. Right? Alright, so with that again I wanna give all praises and all glory to Yahweh Ba Hashem Yahweh Shai, to our honesty the apostles and others of Great Millstone. Right? And um you know Shalom to the black men all in are pushing you with all truth and sincerity. Till next time, Shalom.